Assembly member Lorena Gonzalez will leave Sacramento and be back here in San Diego for the next several months to undergo cancer surgery. She spoke with our ABC 10 News reporter Rena Nakano about her fears and hopes before getting a double mastectomy this weekend. Banners and pink balloons don Assemblywoman Lorena Gonzalez's office in Sacramento. So next week is a big milestone birthday. I'm turning 50. But in her final days of being in her 40s, Gonzalez is facing a life changing surgery. They discovered that, yes, I have two spots um, with cancer in my right breast. She's leaving Sacramento a day early to get a double mastectomy on Saturday. We will remove all the, the tissue and all the cancer, and then depending what they find will determine if I need to do radiation and chemotherapy. On Twitter last month, Gonzalez announced her diagnosis, stage zero breast cancer detected fairly early. But her experience with the disease dates back decades. My mother uh, was diagnosed with breast cancer at age 44. She unfortunately passed away when she was 62. Because of this, since age 35, Gonzalez said she never missed an annual mammogram. But with the chaos of the pandemic, she admits she nearly forgot this year. I learned every day is a gift. Thursday morning, Senator Amy Klobuchar shared her battle with Good Morning America's Robin Roberts. Routine mammogram, um, something I'd put off during the pandemic like so many others, and I found out uh, that I had cancer. It was stage one, but since her lumpectomy and radiation, Klobuchar says she is now cancer free. Her story giving Gonzalez the courage to move forward with her upcoming surgery. That kind of provides some hope as well. It takes away a little bit of the fear. Gonzalez says naturally she's anxious and scared, but she's also hopeful. She says this experience has inspired her to take on more health care issues when she returns back to legislative session in January. It's kind of motivated me to take on a new fight. Most of all, I want people to get screened and not to be afraid because catching it early is what it's about. Rita Nakano, ABC 10 News. She is a fighter wishing her well tonight. Gonzalez says she hopes to celebrate her 50th birthday next Thursday at home as a cancer survivor and is looking forward to her road to recovery.